The Electronic Publishing Group addresses the intersection of personal computing with what are traditionally thought of as mass media, including broadcast television, radio, newspapers, books, and magazines. The project you're watching here, called Newspeak, is an interactive newspaper. It addresses the intersection of reading with that of programming. The newspaper is assembled by computational agents that glean their instructions from the gestures you make as you read the newspaper itself. On the front page, a touch-sensitive screen allows you to make gestures, peruse the articles in detail, and to touch words and find their correlation in other articles on the front page. If you'd like more information about any other article, a gesture on that article opens the newspaper to an internal page, the proverbial page 14, where the continuation of that article is shown as well as related information that may or may not have appeared on the front page of the edition. The articles you see are illustrated from local optical storage as well as from broadcast television. Thus, the newspaper illustrates some of the mergers possible when one adds computers to the receiving end of mass media technologies. In this case, touching the word cable retrieves articles from inside the newspaper and previous editions that feature the word or phrases including the word cable. In this article, the illustrations will be drawn from yesterday evening's broadcast television news. In Bellevue, Texas today, there was an explosion at an oil refinery. It set off a spectacular fire. Two workers are dead. And here's ABC's Charles Murphy. It was a spectacular fire. Flames from burning propane, butane, and gasoline towered 800 feet above a Chevron storage site near Houston. The Electronic Publishing Group has changed the newspaper from being a broadcast by evolving both the technology and the software, the interaction between the news systems, so that each edition of the newspaper is personalized and individual. No two people see the same edition. You also don't necessarily have precisely the same style or form of newspaper presented on successive days. Some of the notions of programming your own information access drawn upon sources of standard mass media are being demonstrated here. In this example, we have a thesis project that explores trying to build a common interface between broadcast and print databases. You can establish your own journals that are drawn from print and broadcast information and have those manipulated in a common interface. In this example, the Electronic Publishing Group is experimenting with a new style of magazine, where the magazine is now published continuously and the act of programming that magazine is akin to reading it. When you touch the articles directly, it draws upon your local library to show you different articles as well as to give you relevant ads and workshops to things that you might be interested in or already own.